Today I'm gonna to show you some muscle motion offense drills. Coach Charlie Attack Basketball Academy. As a premier basketball player development coach, I want to train you today just like I've trained thousands of youth players all over the world for almost two decades. So in this video today, I'm going to show you how to get open in a motion offense. Next, I'm going to show you three most important cuts to know in a motion offense. Last, I'm going to show you the secret trick to creating scoring opportunities in a motion offense. And on top of that, I have one that I'll give to you, but only if you stick around to the very end. In a motion offense, I want you to understand one thing. When a teammate has that ball, there's four teammates that do not have the ball. Everything being equal, 20% times five is 100% because it's five of us on the court. That means 80% of the time, you're playing a game without the basketball. Do the math. If you average, and I'm just keeping it simple, right, not being disrespectful, if you average 10 minutes a game, there's a good chance for eight minutes you're playing without the basketball. In the two minutes you actually have it, you may have the ball in your hands and making a play with that ball for probably 30 plus seconds. Dribble here, dribble there, and that's pretty much it. So I wanna teach you how to move without the ball so when you get it, you don't have to overthink it. What I do, do what I call decision fatigue and just know what to do when you catch it. So first is how to engage your defender. So simply getting open. He's playing defense for me. I kinda wanna, I want you to see this at home. You, you just can't run around. I mean, that's not gonna work. The first thing you have to do is seek first contact. So instead of me running, what I'm gonna do is place my hands on him, right? I have the right to do that. Now I'm not hitting him. I'm actually seeking first contact. And on that, he reacted, bang. You may not see this, but he put his inside hand on mine. That is my cue to pop out. Because when he goes here, relax, he can't really move his left side. So instead of running, what I'm gonna do is just run into his body and put my hand there. Now I have what I want for leverage. Or like Kevin Durant, I'll go here, he goes here, I'll sit. I got my spot, I got what I needed. Hand out, ball's gonna hit my hand, now I have opportunities. That's as simple as that. Let's see if it's a little tougher than that. He's okay with contact. I go contact, you absorb that contact. Now, I may have to go to what I call a face cut. Cutting in front, but it's, it's different ways. But the whole key here is you must engage your defender. You have to learn to become your own screener. By walking him down, changing speeds, he stays with that, popping out, being really agile and versatile because just simply running won't catch it. And another key to this is your start, stop, change of pace, right? I'm running, trying to get open. I can't get open because he's on me like glue. And short closeouts, no one's gonna trust to pass you that ball because you're gonna have to make too many moves. So what I wanna do is walk down to him, change paces. He's chasing now. He catches up, I can square up, I can do whatever. Teammates like that because I'm creating a long closeout. So you must engage your defender and it all starts with your change of pace very simple uh, start stops, but also seeking first contact. They touch you, you pop out opposite. Simple things like that. So now let me go right into the three most important cuts you must learn in a motion offense, right? And they're really rejections. We're gonna reject the offense. We're gonna buck the system a little bit. We're gonna break the script. First cut's a backdoor cut. So let me give you an idea when you backdoor cut. When a defender's inside shoulder, and heads in front of you. He's going up. When it's in front of you, automatically back through a cut. So I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play defender, and I'm also gonna play passer. So what I want you doing is cutting up hard. I'm gonna show, right, go, 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 show, back to a cut. Bang, ball right there, lay up, okay? So a good little drill you can do with your players, coaches. All right, so kind of go in the corner, right? When you see me cut you off, automatic back to a cut. Cut off, nice, good, good. Now come a little high, engage me. It gave me a contact, contact, up, up. good, nice, good. All right, now the second cut, face front cut, because now what's gonna happen, when he comes up, I'm gonna drop my coverage, and that's gonna allow him to cut right in front of my face. So do that again, and when you cut in front of my face, make sure it's tight to cut me off, make sense? Change, go run up, here, cut off, bang, good. Make, make, it, make sure it's tight. Here's a, here's a common mistake we all make. If I cut here and it's not tight, you're gonna do what? See what I'm saying? I gotta make too many moves, right? So we wanna come off that, meet me up, meet me up, meet me up. Stop right there, back it up, back it up, back it up. I wanna cut tight right there, right? Make sense? Right in front of my face, ready, go. Cut, in front of my face, bang. Exactly, good, good, one more. Good, I'm gonna drop, I'm gonna drop, I'm gonna drop. Cut in front of, there you go, nice, good. The third cut, right, all in progression skill. So first, you overplayed it, inside shoulder was high, right? Boom, I went back door. Second, you dropped your coverage. 
you got tighter, but you kind of waited for that back door cut, I cut your face off, right? Now, three is a reverse. Now when you come up, I'm gonna plant my inside foot and spin on you. Cause you're, now you're getting ready for what? You're getting ready for the back door cut and you're getting ready for the face cut. So now I gotta go with my third option. Now you're gonna spin. You're gonna take that inside foot closest to me, which is your right foot. You're gonna sail with both hands, plant that inside foot and drop that left foot back to your target and go. Ready, go. Up, drop, step, spin, bang. Nice, good. Go deep, go deep, up, oh, oh. nice, good. Good, one more. I don't wanna give it away, bang. Nice, oh, I like that. Up, sail, 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 reverse it. Good, perfect, good. I noticed that you're not a subscriber. I develop Premier Basketball Players and roll out 20 high quality videos every month to help you. So click that subscribe button. We talked about breaking the script. We talked about breaking the offense. That's what I mean by that. Like you're getting ready to do a cut and all of a sudden defender, you know, they, they did a good job in the scouting report, but they didn't expect you to go back to a cut, face cut, reverse cut. Now they're gonna play it honest. So now you get the opportunity to not only engage your defender, but, but change directions and speed on your defender to make plays. So we're gonna go right into a V cut, right? Two steps down, set up, make contact, come off into a front pivot, not down shot. Playing defense with you, make contact, boom, exactly. You got that? All right, so you're on your own, here we go. V cut down, good change, shot, good, good, good. Cause see the footwork that goes with the V cut is the front pivot. When you come down and you turn that corner, you wanna lead with your chest inside your shooting box. Down, up, catch, let go. Good. Now, the next cut, they take away the V cut. So all in kind of swing and see, uh, 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 step. So I go V cut, you play tighter, you come up, I engage you, I L cut out. Right, so L cut, because I was down, he stayed tighter, now I pop out. Now the cut that goes with the L cut, the pivot I should say, is an inside pivot. So you want to take now your right foot with your lead foot, I come up, I got out, I plant my pivot foot, left foot, I swing my lead foot, I lift up, knock down that shot. So we go V cut, V cut didn't work, take him up the lane a little bit, then pop out, let's go. Yours down, not there, pop, inside pivot shot. Good, nice. Down, up, pop out, knock down shot. Let's keep the momentum going with that bonus I mentioned earlier. We've covered a lot in this video, and I really want to make sure I'm helping you out. So I'd like to offer you a guide that covers all the muscle and basketball principles and in what switch to apply them. This is a powerful guide of best practice tips and skills empowering you to take charge of your game. Just click the link in the description below. You can download the guide I put together as my gift to you. Enjoy it and keep attacking.